What's good, YouTube? It's Cuddle of Death here. Hey, happy day. Woo! And today, I'm going to be discussing a theory that has stemmed off of the most recent Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon trailer, which will be linked down in the description, so make sure to check that out. Near the end of that particular trailer, we received a bit of footage regarding something that is known as an Ultra Beast. We got a short glimpse of UB01 or Ultra Beast 1 for... Like, if you want to make it a longer version of the name, which is definitely something that I never believed that I would see in a Pokemon game. Pokemon Sun and Moon seem to be getting intense. After that trailer was posted, the website got updated about UB01, so I went and checked it out. Beforehand, though, my timeline on Twitter was filled with what I was thinking. This Ultra Beast has an odd resemblance to Professor Kukui's mysterious assistant, Lily. That might sound a bit crazy to some of you, but to me, it makes sense. Lily was shown off in one of the very early Pokemon Sun and Moon trailers, and she was advertised as being the mysterious assistant. Her information on the official website states that she will play a very important role in the games. Taking a look at UB01's information on the site, however, it reads, BO1's body is composed of a glass-like substance. However, it's constantly changing shapes, never settling on one. While evidence of something like a survival instinct can be observed in UB01, no one knows whether it has a will of its own or any emotions. It's said that for some reason, its movements resemble those of a young girl. If we look back at Lily, there are some physical resemblances between her and UB01 that could tie the two together outside of just the text entries alone. She has a really, really cute hairstyle that's a bit squid-like. UB01 kind of looks like a space squid. <laughs> at least to me it does. In the trailer, we got a very, very small glimpse of UB01 that made it look like it was traveling through some kind of interdimensional rift. Will UB01 actually be a threat though that is one of the questions that i'm curious about even whether it's lily or not i know that the entry on the pokemon sun and moon website states that ultra beasts possess mighty powers and could pose a threat to both pokemon and people but does that mean that they will i don't think that all of them will personally and how many ultra beasts are we going to see anyway my theory is that lily will end up being revealed as ub01 later in the games and she will help fight against the ultra beasts that end up posing a threat and actually want to be jerks to all of us which is not going to be a good fun time, but Lily will come and save the day as UB01. What are your thoughts? Let me know down in the comment section below, or if you make a video regarding the matter, I would love to watch it. Make sure to check out all of my Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon news, theories, speculations, and more. My Pokemon Sun and Moon playlist will be linked down in the description below. I will also be doing a playthrough of both games on release, as well as hunting for shinies. Stay tuned for my other upcoming videos, and thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. Bye!